Good morning, guys. Um, just doing my weekly analysis. Um, today is um, 1st of July, 2019. So just for the week ahead. Um, EURUSD, the first one I'm starting with EURUSD. EURUSD hasn't changed anything from my last week um, analysis. Um, things that I, I was looking for is start, starting to do now. But I'm still waiting. Uh, more of waiting game right now. It's still not there yet where I want to take buy position from. Um, let me get my pen out. Um, this is where I was expecting to get bounce. Um, that was from last week. 13 is the area to look for bullish press action. And then it target, first target 14, around 1430, 1440, and then around 15. But right now, um, I'll be watching out for this, uh, what is actually happening around this area. We'll probably get some bullish, bullish price action here. And we could see continue. Or this is the bit I'm really waiting for. Anywhere around this area, I will not be hesitating to take buy position. So that is my my buy setup, is actual buy setup is somewhere around here. Like anywhere around there, I will be taking it. First target, 14, for around 14, then around 15. So that is the area that I'm waiting for. I still do, Price action suggesting that we probably get this uh, around 12.50 again. And that's when we probably see the bullish price action. So that is the area to watch out for. So I'll be watching out for this area. This is the area that I will be looking for my buy entries. Um, here, potential buy entry, but not confirmed to 12.50 anywhere around this area. That's when I'll be looking for buying entry. So let's see how that market plays out. It's more patient, being patient. I'm just sitting there until market get to that those areas then I'll be ready to look for my entries. Before I get to here, and if I see price back up here, and I see bearish price action, I probably short, take a short position from there. With a tight stop loss, about 20, 30 pips, and target up to here. So it's more of, um, setup is not there yet. It's more of waiting now. So let's see if we get to one of these areas. Um, this is GP, JPY. Um, we did come out last night, um, for the position we held from last week and um, we come out somewhere there and now what i'm looking for is to get a bounce here 3640 area and then i'll be looking for bullish price action and i'll be targeting 38 to 39 area and um, anywhere around this area this is my um buy zone so let's see if we get to there um alternatively um i probably look for go to go short around this area if i see Bearish price section around this area 3740, 3730. I'll just put my stop above here and then I'll target 40, 3640. So that is the alternative um, position I'll be looking to go um, if I see any bearish price section. Um, overall, I'm looking for my um, buy entry. Market is not there yet, so just more of waiting. Some gold, um, gold from sell from 320. 14.20, we did get to the um, target, pretty much missed the target by I think about five or 10 pip. Or oh, is it actually touched? No, I actually touched 80. So 80 was my target from this cell. So, and I, I was, I mean, I was expecting to get, to get a bounce at 30, um, 13.80. So at the moment it's in process of this, but what I'm expecting right now on gold is to do this. To go back test again 20 around 2010 to 20 and we see bearish price action around this area we'll go short again and target 40 13 40. otherwise if you see market just drop here first then we'll look for buy from 13 60 and target back up here so that would be something to uh, something i'll be considering to take my position um right now is 60 is the area that i'll be watching off to go long if I see bullish price action around 1360, that's when I'll be looking to go long. <clears throat> uh, I will be looking for my long entry. And other ways, if I see, it's also, if you notice there, there's a gap here. It opened up with a gap um, last night. So it's this gap is still to be filled. So we could see going back up, filling this gap, and then continue with the downwards move towards maybe around 1260, 12, uh, sorry, 1360, 1350. And this is the area that we sh should, we pro most likely get bullish price action around this area. And another test back to 14, 14, 1420 area again. 
So that is something that I'll be um, <clears throat> looking, looking for my entries. I'll be looking to go short again around 20 and looking long again, 1360 to 1350. So that is what I'm going to do this week. Let's see what the market do. GPUSD. I'm just waiting to see what the market do around this area. Another 50 pips down. What is it? 2640. 20, yeah, 20, at the moment is on 2640. I'll be looking for 25, 25, 2570, anywhere around this area. This is where I'll be looking for my long entry. So let's see what, what the market do. At the moment, with Brexit uncertainty, we're seeing bearish move taking place. But I am expecting bullish move to take place soon. I'm just waiting for that area. Let's get into a four hourly. That'll probably give us a bit more clear. Yeah. So basically, I'm waiting for this area here. Um, four hourly indicating is more of um, selling pressure. So this is what I'm waiting for. Anywhere around this area, I'll be looking for bullish price action and I'll be targeting 2850 area. Anyway, this is the area that are my area to go look for long position. And um, that would give us very good risk reward. We can just put our stop anywhere below this low and then we can target this. So that'll be very good risk reward to, to go long. So that is something for you guys to watch out for as well, these levels. Um, so none of the trade is there yet for me to take position. At the moment, they're just waiting. It's Monday. So there's no rush. We got a whole week to to um, trade. We don't need to trade every hour. Let's wait for it. Get those trades at right position and then take it. And that way we'll get very good risk reward rather than jumping in, staying in negative four days. Um, so that's all guys in terms of my um, setup for this week. Those are the pairs that I will be monitoring and those are the pairs that I will be looking to take my positions based on all the markup is there. I'm just waiting for market to get to there and take my position. All right, thanks a lot guys. And hopefully, um, well, well, I'll see you guys soon. Take care and happy trading.